Okay, good morning, good morning, good morning. Stocks go up, stocks go down. Then we see, then we see, then we see. Interesting, interesting. We broke 4,700 uh, late yesterday. It couldn't hold the 20 up. Market can't seem to hold. Uh, we got the jobs. I think if it comes in at 160 or 158, I'm thinking somewhere around there, it's a Goldilocks number and we rock it. If it comes in at 200, we probably dive, even though we shouldn't. And if it comes in at 100, they'll start talking recession. Now, who, who knows? I don't know. But here's the thing. This is how you play the game. And I'm going to repeat this so you guys get smarter. You start the week slow with SPXs. You buy small SPXs and you buy some coin puts and coin goes up so you make 15K. You subtract five for the SPX loss, you're up 10. Okay, then you buy some Lily and you make 27K and you sell it. And you bought some SPXs and, and you bought some Lamb Research and you bought some other stuff. So you're down 12K. So you're up 15 plus the 10, you're up uh, 25. Your Boeing goes out, so you lost 10. So you're up 15 again right? Uh, you buy some more SPXs for yesterday uh, and you're down another five. So you're up 10. But then you have, and then, but then you have SMCI. So you sell those. So you now you're back up 20, right? And you bought some Lily, I mean, LRCX, which was up a triple, but you didn't take it but you, because you, only, you didn't buy enough. See, the problem is when you don't buy enough, you don't sell it. You just buy 10 or 15 or 20. It's only a thousand bucks. You don't sell it. So you're net net positive for the week. Okay. You're not up 30, 40, 50, 80 grand, but you're positive 10 plus grand. And that's it. You just chill and wait, chill and wait and chill and wait. Now you don't count the coin 120s or you'd be uh, just up a little bit. Okay. So, so that's how it works. That's how it works. Uh, questions for today. All these ETFs are saying they're going to do it, but would they ever do that during market hours? Guys, don't, I, I, I tell you all the time, I don't trust anybody. Anybody. On anything. Somebody puts news out there, go look. Yesterday, ETF, Sam ETF got approved. It didn't get approved. Just somebody else, they, they approve the application. I mean, <laughs> look, if the ETF is approved, Bitcoin is, is going to go to 45, 50,000 right away in minutes. At least a few trades would take it to 50,000. If it doesn't, then it's probably not approved. And if it doesn't, or if it does, what happens to coin? Does it collapse? I, I told you this. Let's say Bitcoin's worth a trillion. I don't think it is, but say it's worth a trillion. What, what are they going to get? They're not. Nobody's paying them one percent. If they're paying a one percent, they still don't make enough revenue to to be worth where it is. Nobody's paying a one percent to be a custodian. Who the hell is doing that? I mean, they're lucky if they get I don't know maintenance fee of twenty dollars an account from. Whoever doing it, that's it. So, so grossly overvalued, okay? Uh, and then we see, then we see, then we see. Now, does it collapse? I don't know. Does it rocket? I don't know. So, I we're in it for the upside and the downside, and that'll take us probably about to even. So, not a bad week. You know, all you have to do is hold Lily. We sold Lily and, and made twenty seven k. If we held Lily, okay, we'd be way, 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 way up, right? Be way, 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 way up because they, they went to 17. And why did Sam buy 100? Why did Sam buy 100? Come on, guys. Of Lily while he's buying small and everything else. Why did he, Sam buy 100? Got to know this. Got to know this. Got to know this. Come on, guys. You know this. Somebody knows this. At least one person knows this. Because you had a beast number, and because if you wait, if uh, you guys got to learn my uh, 
my my analogy of you sit next to the hot girl. If the hot girl finally talks to you, do you not are you not happy and you buy it into that? It finally hit six oh three. So what are you gonna do if NVIDIA goes to break seven oh three? I mean uh five oh three. People are going to say, well, I'm going to buy one contract, Sam. It finally got to 503. That's when you wait. That's when you go. Okay, once again, let's go over the, the three other things. Because uh, job report's coming here. Uh, Microsoft has to give co-pilot numbers. Okay? AMD has to say how their chip is selling. Okay? Uh and then if, if and when NVIDIA breaks, 503. NVIDIA's got a monster upgrade this morning. I mean, really, really huge upgrade. Uh, was not fast enough on Lily. Uh, absolutely not fast enough. But here's the thing. It doesn't matter if you're fast enough and you're slow. That's okay. You still got to get in. You don't just give up on it. Can't give up on it. Now, today, very different. If Lily breaks 603 to the downside, last time it hit 621 and it broke 600, for the next nine, ten weeks, for two, three weeks, it tried to get back up. But then for ten weeks, it didn't move up. Didn't move up. And it's not a game changer. Everybody thinks this news on Lily is a game changer. They didn't lower the price, guys. People are lying to you. If they were charging $1,000, the middleman was getting, say, 250 So now they cut out the middleman, and they're going to charge 750 do you see what I'm saying? So they're still only getting seven fifty. They're not getting any more money. So for them, they're just trying to create this new vision. Okay, here comes the jobs. Guys, let's see what happens. We bought some puts just in case, just to have them. You got to have them. I mean, you're not buying a lot. You just buy some, okay? Let's see what happens here. Yeah, and it's not only here. Uh, if you look at uh, Hold on, Tech. Hold on. Still not coming. I mean, think about this. Lamb Research was way up. Today, but AMAT's but SMCI is up with it, too. It may hit 300 really, 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 really fast. Okay. Uh, here they are. Let's go. Wow, two sixteen. That means definitely no recession. That means rates will pop higher. Okay, they're going to say no cuts. This isn't necessarily bad. But rates will go up. They may take the market down. NVIDIA went down on this because they're going to say uh, back to where we were. Okay? Interesting, interesting, interesting. The SPX is going lower. Well, those are up to two bucks. Uh, we may take three on those and then get back in. Okay, that's where we know. Okay? So let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. This is not bad news. It's not great news. It's not Goldilocks, but it's not bad news. Okay? Uh, you got SPX 4682, 4661, 4630. Needs to get through 4718. Okay? 4718, then 4752. Upside. Avago, uh, 1021 down, uh, 1072 up. NVIDIA, 481. Very, this thing may go all the way to 486 at open. Okay, they may run this one to 486 at open, and I mean, really, really, really fast. Our SPXs are moving. Uh, SPX down 25, right? Okay, hold on. Uh, so that's what we know. That's what we know. That's what we know. Uh, Nvidia, we did that. Adobe, uh, 609. Uh, Land Research, 736, 742 underneath 721. Uh, Lily, 609, 603 down. 616, 631 up. AMD, 139, 139 down. Uh, I'm 139 up, I'm sorry, 131 down. Uh, coin, they're saying this ETF comes out, but I, I don't think anything ever comes out during the day. 
I don't know. I don't know what's going on with it, but here's the thing: uh, coin doesn't make any more m money. I keep telling you that. So if if it comes out and Bitcoin doesn't rip, they're going to take it way down. Goldman Sachs, three eighty eight, three seventy nine. Uh, Boeing, two forty eight. Can't seem to go. Think about it. People at two sixty four. It's down twenty points. A stock of the year is down twenty points. What's that tell you about brokerages? Caterpillar. Uh, Where's the puts here? If it collapses, it can go to 179 here. If they say no rate cuts, then Caterpillar is back to 250. CMG, if it gets all the way down to 2100, we're going to buy the 2300s. Uh, McDonald's says things are bad. It can break 90. Uh, Netflix, I, these guys are clowns. I mean, you got 503 up, 452 down. UPSD working lower, 31, 27, AFRAM, 39, 36, SMCI, 291, 300, Microsoft, 366, 362, NOW, very, very cheap for next week, implies it's not going anywhere, 652 down, Tesla, 229, 229, 229, that's what we know, that's what we know, everybody have a great trading day, see you in chat.